everybody, how are y'all doing? My name's Lulu with Lulu Thrifting World. Thank you for visiting my channel. I'm gonna show you guys a video of me opening up my DIY t-shirt box. It's 25 t-shirts. Um, for I paid around $37 and change, but I'm gonna go ahead and open up the box and um, show you guys what I got. I ordered this on threadup.com um, under their rescue boxes. And I ordered this box with a $5 ThreadUp credit. I, I'm not sure if you guys done this, but I just discovered like a few weeks back, um, ThreadUp emailed me, um, get a $5 credit by search and save or something like that. Like I had to go on my account and just save like a brand I like or something. So I went ahead and did that and they gave me a credit, but the only thing is, is that the credit expires like really fast. Like they only give you two or three days to use it. So I just went ahead and used it for a DIY t-shirt box. I enjoy the DIY t-shirt boxes. It may not always be like big money or anything, though one time I ended up getting two Harry Styles t-shirts. Harry Styles, is that his name? Some famous, um, singer guy but anywho that was like a long time ago um and i hadn't ordered a diy t-shirt box in almost a year so i'm gonna go ahead and uh open this with you guys and show you what i got i went and opened or uh ripped the tape already so let me get this oh i thought i ripped it wow they really uh Take this up. They take the sides. Crazy. <laughs> Let me just rip it on off. Okay. Here's my receipt. So, let's see. I have my notes on here. I wrote notes on like how much it would be each, but um, so rescue DIY t-shirts, $28. Oh, it doesn't have the total on here, but I guess they're usually $28, but the freaking shipping is like $10.99. So um, with the $5 credit and taxes, everything was $37 and change or $38 and change. And I ended up calculating that the t-shirts would be around $1.50 each if I were to resell all 25. But I know there might be something I might like or um, I'm going to end up donating some. So we shall see. I put bubbles in here. Oh yeah, where did it come from? This box came from, gosh, I cannot read. Georgia, Georgia. So, this is the inside. So let's get that on. They like put five, 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 and then they roll it up. Ugh, oh goodness. So, I don't know what this is. A-E-R-I-E. -E. Ori or Airy, extra small, mint green shirt, woman's shirt. See, and this is an extra small. I feel like I can wear this and I'm not an extra small. Interesting. Anyways, here's that. I'd probably keep it. I don't think I'd resell that, but yes. Let's see. Time and True Extra Large White Shirt. I believe this is a Walmart brand and I'd keep it. I'm not gonna resell it, I think I'm gonna keep it, but it's nice and white. There's no stains that I see. This 
This is a Hollister gray small shirt. A girl's shirt. Nice condition. Maybe I'd resell it. Talbot's size large petite woman's polo shirt. This is nice. Definitely a petite, I can tell. And I don't see any stains and I don't see rips or anything. So definitely we'll resell that. And here's a gray shirt, Banana Republic, size small. I'd probably just give it to somebody. I don't think I would um, resell this at all, but, but it's not in like terrible condition. If it was my size, I'd keep it for myself, but I'd probably just give it to a neighbor. Put that over there. Here's the other batch. Ooh, this is a lot in here. I see something new with tags. Uh, this is Chico size one. Oh, this is interesting. It has buttons in the back. And it's like a tannish color with these little tiny gold dots. I think it's very cute and I will definitely resell this. Ooh. Back to reality with the rose on it. Smog, regular fit, size small. I don't know if that's like a book a movie I'll look it up but it seems to be in pretty good condition there's no there's no rips and it's not like faded like used up black t-shirt so I'm gonna put this inside and research that cotton on size medium thank you t-shirt Maybe I'll resell it, maybe. Put that aside. And this one is called Ambiance Size 3X White T-shirt with a front pocket. Um, I don't see stains on this thing. I've heard of ambiance, but I don't know how, how that brand is, but this is a pretty good condition white t-shirt. So I'll put that inside in the maybe I'll resell section. <sighs> this one is Ram We. Ram We with tags. Here's the tag right here. It's a black t-shirt size medium. I don't know if this is a kid's t-shirt. Is this a size women's medium? Nice graphic. I'm gonna try to resell that. Honey punch size medium made with love. Retail, the tax says I think 42 and they slashed it to 19. It's like a white distressed t-shirt, short sleeve. I don't see any stains. It's actually a cute t-shirt. I'm gonna go ahead and try to resell this one. Navy, new 
with tags. It was on clearance for $3.97 and the retail was $24.99. Lux Small. What is Lux Small? Because this is big. I don't know, that's so weird. Looks small. Anyways, that's that. I'm gonna try to resell it. Nice yellow t-shirt, next level. I've seen that tag before. And it says, let's take a trip. And it's new because it has that sticker um small and then on the back it says chuco relic or something i don't know what that is but i'll research it but i'll definitely um list this one it looks fun and bright and nice and it's in great condition this one is free state size small Faded black t-shirt, skull with roses. I guess it's supposed to look like that faded black because there's like a tag. But I wonder if the tag's from like a thrift store. Maybe, it kind of has those, the thrift store smell. I don't know. Because it looks distressed. We'll see about that one. And we have another new with tags, Nike. And it says Tar Heels, number one, women's V-neck. Wait, Nike. Oh, it's like a college t-shirt. Size small, college, college jeeps or whatever t-shirt, tar heels. I don't know, I gotta look at what college this is. M, C, North Carolina, anywho. I like that, I'm gonna resell it. And here's the next bunch. This is fun. I like going through this box. Oh, this is like a small kid's shirt or something. J. Crew Perfect Fit Extra Small. White collared shirt. It looks like a girl's shirt. Because this is not a woman's extra small. I'll look into that and see. Maybe I'll resell it. Raglan shirt. Uh, let's see. Bella canvas size 2XL. Raglan shirt. What's the size right there? It's in good condition. It looks like, I don't know, like a weird strange world. We've got aliens and dinosaurs and giant frogs in there. Interesting. Another new with tags. Universal Thread, Target brand. Just a cotton shirt. Shoot, I'm gonna keep this. I need new shirts. I like it. I like Universal Thread. Uh, let's see. Navy blue, new with tags. Gap, extra large.
the retail for that one was $24.95, but clearly it was on clearance. I'll resell it. It's in great condition. It's nice material, like thick and new. Cotton on, size small, black long sleeve with some old cars on it, 79. I don't see any holes. And the color of the shirt, oh, I do see like, I don't know if you can see that, like rips or distress <laughs> on the rim, the hem of the shirt. I don't know, we'll see about this cotton on. Oh, it seems like it's like that on the collar too, but you know what? Like that other shirt that was new with tags with distressing on it, I guess that's like a style or something. And I've seen something like that before at the store a long time ago, but yeah, I'm gonna look into this to possibly resell. This is a genuine merchandise um, ML, like the baseball people. <laughs> <laughs> size small women's uh, I don't know what team this is Giants San Francisco Giants shut the front door it's kind of it's faded like on the graphics see but I still list even if it's um, a little distressed looking on the graphic I think it looks kind of cool, like vintage-y, vintage I don't even know if that's a word, but um, yeah, I'm gonna try to sell this one. San Francisco Giants is huge out here. I'm happy with this box. Let me tell you, because they're from a long time ago when I would order them, they weren't always great. This is also new with tags, Old Navy, like a heather olive green color medium it's just solid shirt <laughs> i might keep this one too <laughs> oh i love it i love t-shirt boxes this is like a ribbed t-shirt a new day i think that's target medium ribbed green shirt I'm probably gonna donate it. It's just like a whatever ribbed green shirt. Two more, this one and then one more. So this is a white t-shirt, just plain old white t-shirt, Lucky Brand. It's pre-owned. I mean, there's no tags on it or anything, but I don't see um, stains and it's bright white and it feels, um, it feels new. So I might sell it, I don't know. It's in great condition. And last but not least, let's make a sure. Air Apostle size large, New York, the five boroughs, the Bronx, like a charcoal gray crew neck t shirt. And I'm gonna sell it. I'm gonna list this t shirt and sell it. And there's a lot here that I plan to resell. I I got a good bunch. I'm really happy with my t-shirt box. And there's also a few shirts that I'm keeping that's new with tags, which I really like. Yay. Uh, so let me see how many I got. Cause sometimes they give you more and I want to make sure they didn't give me less. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, ah, nine, 
10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, and 25. So that is my DIY t-shirt box. I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, please give it a like. And if you enjoy these type of videos, episodes about reselling, thrifting, hauling, please subscribe to my channel. I greatly appreciate it. And I need to look for my, there it is, my little control. Um, I greatly appreciate you guys visiting and I hope you all have a great day, a great week. And if I don't throw out a video again by the 4th of July, have a happy 4th of July. Bye.